Warning, the time wasted watching this video is non-refundable. How did it get so cold in San Francisco? It's freezing. It was so nice. The sky is gray. Well, no, there's some blue right there. I lied, there's blue right there. But it's so cold. I got my, I'm, I'm even cold in, in my parka. It's insanity. But it's not as cold as Canada. Canada was cold. Remember that? That's a big giant puddle. And those are pumas. I'm kind of but I, I don't have winter boots. I have a parka. Um, we'll make it work. So uh, right here is a whole bunch of ice. So I just got back from Montreal, Canada, where I was asked to come down and be a part of the FUBAR TV show. My old friend Dave Lawrence, uh, basically, he, he plays Terry, and he, uh, he wanted to write me in, as, uh, kind of playing myself, so Terry hires Dirty Donnie, the artist, to do a logo for his business. And uh, anyways, I'm, I might make it on the cutting room floor. Um, I might be in the show, so... Either way, it was just a really cool experience to go down and to, you know, uh, check out the whole set. And, um, just kind of hang out for the week and see how they shoot everything. So basically what this little video that I got is, it's the, the Sunday that I got there. No one was working, so Dave took me into the studio to show me their whole set and give us a little tour and explain the show and what they're doing. Uh, very cool. Thank you guys for having me, and I hope you guys enjoy this uh, little video. You're watching Daddy TV. I don't hey, know. what's up? It's uh, probably a bit dark. It's gonna get brighter here. So we're this is the this is the Fubar. This is the Fubar set, right? This yeah, it's the, it's a the TV show based on uh, based on Fubar called uh, the working title is Fubar Age of Computer. So keep your uh, you, yeah. Who knows? I don't know when this is gonna be out, but maybe you've already seen it. Uh, but we're here in the sixth floor in Montreal. So it's Fubar and Vice together. I think maybe something that was always meant to be. Up to the 12th floor to um, build a basement. So originally it was called the basement tapes, or like we did a little demo of those. Just, oh, that was like your vlog that you guys were doing? And I shot in my basement. You were telling me about, yeah. So yeah, here's the basement. Uh, there's, it, it's, it's a bit overwhelming in terms of how much stuff is in here. Uh, but that we definitely amazing. have some Donnie artwork up here. There's a little bit there. And, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, Here's that's a, a really pound of fake weed that we we use bitcoins to buy in the episode. So where'd you get where'd you get that? Did you buy that like on eBay? Is there a fake weed or did you make it? Oh, this is fake weed. It's actually styrofoam, carved styrofoam wrapped in oregano with, oh, with uh, super adhesive. Oh, that's fucking crazy. So it looks pretty real. <laughs> it looks, like, yeah, it looks real. It smells like uh, spray glue. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so you do get stoned off it. Yeah. Um, there's a computer and shit. You know, there's yeah. security cameras. This is Terry's sort of main hub. This is where I Skype call everybody. So yeah, um, you know, we'll do like online dating and all sorts of stuff. There's cameras all over the place. Yeah. Uh, Pilsner, you know, they've been really good to us. Uh, yeah, you said Pil Pilsner gave you like a whole pallet. Yeah, they gave us two and a half thousand beers. That's fucking crazy. Was that a pallet? Or yeah, was that's that, a pallet. That's beer. a pallet. Yeah. That's fucking, that's nice. Um, we got, oh, you got that boom box, dude. Wow. Yeah, check out this one. This one, uh, we haven't fired it up yet, but it's an old, my friend gave this to me. It's an old thing. It has, has actually a TV in it, a cassette player oh, yeah. with a, the TV. So you oh, can, rad. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's, we, we that's cool. We haven't fired it up, but I think oh, we're going to put one of the security cameras on there. Oh, cool. Those are so collectible now, like boom boxes. They're yeah. like, they're hard to get, you yeah. know? So here's Look Terry's place, man. Uh, this is crazy. The, the lighting board's not here, so we can't get all the light up. This is the Terry's personal helicopter he's working on. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> then awesome. if you, we blew a hole through the wall here in the second episode, and this is where Dean and her studio is. Oh, shit. So this is where, uh, you know, I had to bring in a lot of mattresses to try to get the sound down so it's not too loud to get that sweet spot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and this is uh, our art department. Uh, Louisa built this, I uh, can't turn them all on, but it's a, it's an 80 in one strobe light thing. <laughs> it's amazing when it's on. It's got like, it's just, it's, it's crazy. So whenever we have people on the show, they have to kind of like squat here. And then when the cameras go, they, they kind of pretend like they're Oh, gotcha. Yeah, down, yeah, yeah. Because so. there's like a, a door to, to nowhere, I guess. Yeah, yeah, and then yeah, we, yeah. I'll show you the other, the actual yeah. upstairs. Yeah. This is where I climbed okay. up into the roof there. Terry, when we drank cherry wine, we got. Oh, okay, it's like a crawl space kind yeah. of thing. You are watching. Yeah. This is 
is Sunday, so nobody's here. Yeah. So you're, I'm getting, we're getting the tour. Here's the, the, here's the, this is actually the Kerry's laptop. Yeah. So they can populate it, and then I'm, I'm, I'm out there. So I actually oh, okay. it, and they can hit me with like pop-ups, like spam. Oh, okay. And then so I have to like kind of combat it. And yeah. Like, so so what they're doing on that, you're seeing on that. Yeah. yeah. I, I'm okay. operate it mostly, but they can sometimes help populate it with stuff or like arrange for the Skype calls and yeah. that kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. And then this is Wheels' this set, our character named Wheels. This is sort of her bedroom. When we do fight scenes, this is where okay. we would show people coming in. And then this is where like Shanks upstairs is. And yeah. That's pretty much the whole set. So Donnie's, uh, Terry, in episode four, the, uh, it's the Arowana episode where Terry does drone delivery. And he, he, he flies drones out of here and delivers weed in the Ogden neighborhood. And then he decides to get a van so that he can like go remote further out. So yeah. Donnie's going to do the decals for the Arowana business and help Terry get the idea to pimp his van. Awesome. Thanks for having me out. Yeah, it's no a super fun. It's yeah, awesome. We're in Montreal. film. Or it's in Montreal, but it takes place in Calgary. It's yeah. supposed to. Yeah. yeah, it's a little yeah, confusing, yeah. but it makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Right on. Awesome. Cool. Thanks. Thanks, dude. Yeah, give her. Cool, man. Ooh. Yeah. Montreal. Winter. Snow. Lots of slush. It's kind of crazy. Uh, weather's not too bad. Uh, had a lot of fun shooting with Dave and the Fubar crew. Um, it was really cool they had me out. Me and Dave did a few things yesterday. And, uh, yeah, it's gonna be pretty cool. Um, I'm going to get breakfast. A little hungover. We partied last night. And I uh, just wanted to show you guys what the uh, Canadian winters are like. Back in San Francisco, no snow. It's fucking right on. You want any glass to do? Thank you, fuck man. Really glad uh, you fucking made it on there. Um, you know, maybe you could help me out with some of your contacts. Like maybe, maybe you could get me like a fucking Rodian for for Metallica there, because I know you knew them. Like I seen it in your fucking book there. Yeah. Like, I, I maybe can... they want to meet me. Yeah. You know. <laughs> but they might want to meet me. You know. Like maybe, backstage maybe. passes or something. Get Fuck, some tickets, you know? maybe. Oh, that would be great. Like. Uh... I'd have to ask. It's not my company. I just do hard work. Oh. Them. Fuck it. I don't know. When you're busy, when you're doing better, yeah, yeah. Like it, maybe know, when like I have a, ask, a spare two hundred thousand dollars, like you know, maybe that will happen, and I'll be able to. I'll be like, I'll order a hundred of them. Yeah, and you could draw it. Yeah. Yeah, because like I don't, I don't really have a business partner anymore, you know, and and like fucking Dean there, you know, he's been jamming in there, and I've been trying to help him out a lot, and now he's got like this new fucking like girlfriend manager. And you know now I'm like fine. You fucking not. basically I'm the lone wolf, just like you. Yeah, you working know? for yourself. Uh, yeah, I'm working yeah. for myself. I was looking at your shit, and I'm like, fuck, Donnie and I are like right in line. You know? Yeah, you worked alone. I've worked alone my my whole yeah my whole career. Yeah, yeah I'm sure, maybe sure. that's my problem. Maybe I should have started alone. Yeah. Cause I like one partner fucking let me down. You know, I had a good idea to expand the business, and he fucking went ape shit. So. You know. Yeah, and working alone, it's it's kind of the way to go. You know, I mean, I, you don't gotta, you don't. It's it's. I mean, this isn't like 1981. This is it's like future, man. You know, you can just you don't gotta go to school. You just go online and go on YouTube and right. You can learn anything you want. You know, and yeah. business is doing good. It's cool. I, right. I think it's gonna, you know. Right, right, yeah. Just a nice, well, uh, you know. Maybe one day you'll want to partner with me. You know, like maybe you'll be like, oh fuck, Terror, I want to work on your ideas. <laughs> hey, that's a good name. Like maybe. Maybe I'll be like Coca-Cola, where I'll like start up a secret Pepsi and it could be joints and drones. Hey, that might happen. That rolls off the tongue too. Oh, so like, uh, you know, Dean, Dean, I've been like, you know, I tried to fucking help him with his band, and, um, you know, and then he, he hooked up with this like chick and, and she's like, she's basically like his manager girlfriend and shit, right? And so mm -hmm. uh, now I'm just like in the background pulling fucking extension cords. Working alone is the best. That's what, I mean, that's what I do, you know, it's, it's just, it's, it's yeah. the best, yeah. Your own hours. Yeah, you make your own hours, you know, you sleep in, you get up whenever you want, you yeah. work when you want. I don't know. You know, this, this, if this fucking arowana goes, like, I might not even 
include my silent partner. You know, I might just like silence my silent partner. But you know what? We're, you know, we're, like, we're, 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 we're practically partners because you helped me with my logo. So we're not partners. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, like maybe you could make me a pinball machine. You know, we could partner on that to start. And if, the, if we yeah. sell a whole bunch of pinballs, and you know, we don't even have to include Dean. You know, we don't have to have them involved in the pinball. Well, here's the thing with pinball. It's, it's for, for one, it's not my company. I just do artwork for them. Like, right. You know, I, I could put you in contact with the people. It's very yeah. expensive to do a pinball machine. But usually when you do a game, it's like a band. They want like a band. So maybe we could actually get Nightseeker and do a Nightseeker pinball. Yeah, no, no, I don't think that would work. No. No.